Scott, back to construction tech. You've been working at Dozer for five years now. Mm-hmm. You're a huge part of the growth. Um, what's the biggest difference between working uh, on site uh, versus you know being in the office and part of a construction tech company? Um, the the big big difference is, um, I mean, the the learning curve from from the transition um, that was was pretty steep. Um, it was a challenge I really wanted to accept. Um, operating, um, is, is, is a lot of fun. And I always enjoyed the, the specs and details of the equipment. Um, so that really helped me transition to the tech side of it and what we're doing at Dozer. Um, I love to be, you know, a a pseudo, uh, product expert. Um, I like to know and, and read up on equipment. Um, so I think that's helped me with the transition. Um, I've also never been much of a tech uh, guy. I, I, you know, I relied on, on, on people with more information to, uh, to help me, you know, set up my cell phone and, and things like that. Um, so that was a lot of fun to learn all that. Um, honestly, the first few days at Dozer, um, you know, I was given a, a lot of tech and a lot of information and um, it, 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 was uh it was overwhelming a little bit but um fun to to dig into all that info and to find out and find a way to ap- imp- apply my operator knowledge and my product knowledge to what we're doing and what um dozer's all about and i i hope and i, I think it's been beneficial to to teach people you know a little bit about the the little nuances of of the equipment and um and help dozer move forward and and be is is knowledgeable and aware of what we're renting um and help the customers because i think that's hugely important getting the customers what they need for the project Yeah, for sure, Scott. I know that the uh, the team and uh, you know customers definitely value um, you know the uh, the real life um, experience in the equipment uh, and knowing that there's uh, there's people here on the other side of the the email, text message, phone call, uh, you know that have been in the equipment, know how to operate it, and uh, uh, you know can speak to the the real life challenges. Um, Scott, how do you think uh, um, other people could make that transition? What what skills uh, should they uh, highlight in making that move? Um, I think I think the biggest um, for me it was really wanting to make the change. Um, every I think the the having an open mind and. Um, the the want to to try new things um i i i knew that being an operator was was a passion of mine and i i love doing it um but this was a a great challenge and a good um i think a re- just a really fun experience to um a great road to go down um the be being open to um uh, learning, um, asking questions. Uh, I think asking questions, I've had many conversations with, um, all the departments at Dozer, um, learning about, uh, what we're doing, um, what the, the technology is, um, and trying to understand it and see how I can work with that or apply that. Um, I mean, I was, I was not, a, a, a proficient with computers, it, to the point that I am now. Um, but I attribute that to just asking questions and not being afraid to, um, to, uh, you know, let people know you're not sure. Um, you know, you don't always have to be the expert. There's, there's experts out there and, and asking those questions and getting that information, um, and sharing is, is definitely going to help you, um, succeed. But, uh, yeah, just being willing to to make the move and to really um, accept a new challenge, I think, is the biggest part. Uh, everything else will just fall into place. Um, yeah, you can you can learn anything. Sounds like there's uh, some characteristics and personality traits that uh, 
really transfer over from, you know, being in the seat uh, uh, of a tractor or an excavator or rock truck to, you know, um, being inside and, uh, uh, you know, working at a, a construction tech company. Yeah, I, I think that, uh, um, you know, y- you go from people in construction are always really uh, eager to move to the next piece of equipment and learn something. Um, so I, I, I don't see why the transition to tech um, for me was the exact same thing. Uh, it was just another piece of equipment, another um, another forum to learn. Um, so it was I, I think that transition could be made fairly easily. <laughs> 